What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to your home for everything local sports. It's JJ. And Mike, and the CIF State Basketball video is brought to you by Naples Rib Company, the perfect place to cater your next team event. Treasure in the Pyramid on Saturday, CIF Southern California Regional Championship, pitting Long Beach Poly and Chaminade against each other again. It's the Open Division Championship everyone's been talking about, <laughs> as Chaminade is led by Liana Odom and Valerie Higgins, both game changers. So, Long Beach Poly head coach Carl Bugs and staff went back to the drawing board, got some new ideas, particularly a zone, to try and slow down the Eagles and use their size and athleticism to kind of wear Chaminade down a little. Yeah, easier said than done. These two teams, some of the best in California. And from the tip, you knew we were in for a good one. Both teams quickly answering each other. Andy, get your gun time. Anything you can do, I can do better. But it was the supporting cast of the Eagles, the ones doing the damage in the first quarter as Isabel, hello, Newman, with the and one, Chaminade up 18-9 at the end of one. So you're thinking maybe this is going to be like the Southern Section Championship, which was pretty lopsided for Chaminade at times. But second quarter, Jackrabbits come out rededicated to getting the ball inside and it works along with some easy buckets given up by Shamanai. But oh, 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 Odom showing that, that smooth game that had her dominating this matchup two weeks ago on her way to 19 points and 17 rebounds in this game. Looks like Shamanai's gonna be up seven at the half, but not if Danae Miller has anything to say about it. Stop, pop, drop from the top at half. Shamanai just up four. But Polly rides that momentum into the second half where the improved ball movement sparked a 12-1 run to take the lead back. Defense also key as that zone defense held Chaminade scoreless for 7.58 across the second and third quarter. Impressive third from the green and gold, but the Eagles fly high and they score in bunches. Higgins dishes to Odom, then Odom from downtown. They are going to take the lead right back in a flash with a 6-0 run. Chaminade up 38-37 at the end of the third. It's crunch time and we were not disappointed. These two teams going back and forth. No one pulling away, it's DJ, it's Valerie Higgins getting loose. I mean, this, this bucket looked like it could be the deal because it put them up four, but then right back at you, DJ, again to the 10. DJ run that track back, the big time layup from Jackson who had probably the best game of her career. On the other end, Odom, it's 47-47 with 20 seconds left. Carl Bugs has the ball and calls a timeout to draw something up. So it's gonna be Sierra Belvin with the inbound. She's gonna find Jasmine Jones. She shakes loose from the defender. Yanni Clark is there, she's all alone, but she pulls the ball back out inexplicably to Jones. She's gonna lose it, but DJ there with the scoop and the score. Nine seconds left, Paulie's up 49-47. Two groups of people here, one celebrating with DJ, <laughs> the other saying, Yanni, what happened? Either way, I'm sorry, Ms. Jackson, that was something else, and it should have been, JJ, perhaps the March dream moment for Polly, but instead, Higgins brings it up, they're going to Odom, she gets a look from deep, and oh my dear God in heaven, what is that? A shooter's roll <laughs> is what you call that. Chaminade with the winner. Oh my goodness, we have covered a lot of basketball in this building, as you might know. We've never seen a basketball do that inside the Walter Pyramid. Polly just devastated, obviously. Chaminade with the winner. March is truly mad, Mike. It is indeed, and obviously this is just Chaminade's year. The Eagles going on to the Open Division State Championship. We'd like to thank all of our sponsors, including our newest one, Long Beach Transit. Their route number one now stops at Cal State Dominguez Hills, South Bay Pavilion, and the StubHub Center. It does not run to Sacramento. However, there will be a bus leaving from 1600 Atlantic as the Long Beach Poly boys team will be up there. We'll be making the trip as well. So you can finish off the basketball season with the Jackrabbits in style.